Come on, admit it. You've all done a selfie, and generally, you post the good ones and delete the ones that aren't so flattering. But a Winnipeg artist has started a social media project that encourages Canadians to snap away even when the picture is less than perfect. Here's Global's Ashley Carter. I like this actually, I'm quite impressed. It's an unassuming storefront window that's capturing far more than just your reflection. If you can't love yourself, like you can't be happy with anybody. So yeah, like this is awesome. I've never, like I come down here every day and I've never seen this before. Behind the glass, a mirror where hundreds of Winnipeggers have been encouraged to stop and take a selfie, no matter how they look, no matter what they're wearing. I'm not wearing any makeup at all. I like my hair was wet this morning when I left the house. I yeah, I look awful today. And felt awful until she read the uplifting messages painted on the glass. Basically telling me to love who you are, like be proud of who you are. The mission of the Heart Every Body project, created by artist Cal Barteski for the Women's Health Clinic on Graham Avenue. What we're hoping people will do is be sort of interested by the art as they walk by and there's a little sort of inset where you can sort of walk in there and experience the script and the art and the feelings and the thoughts that are all around you. And that, that, is yeah. very, that is very cool. Men and women of all ages have snapped a pic, like Justine Sutherland who feels the pressures of being a teenage girl. So that's a lot of pressure and like wearing makeup or how your hair is or you can't you can't be yourself all the time. Still, there's a lot of pressure for all the kids, not just way more than when I was young. But I think every woman struggles with it at some point. Using the hashtag Heart Everybody, selfie takers are asked to share their pictures on social media. If people walk away feeling really positive about themselves, and if we can do that for more people, that would be amazing. The installation will run until the end of November, but Barteski hopes it will also pop up in different cities across the country. Ashley Carter, Global News.